A brief tutorial on something a little bit different. It is a tutorial on how to install the actual editor and not the mod SDK. Now, just a few minutes ago when I started recording this, uh, right before then, I got a message from a few people, and actually a lot of people, wondering why the editor looks different than mine. Now, mine is the sandbox editor. The one that Crymod has up on their website currently is the mod SDK. It is different from this. Let me save my level really quick and show you what it is. Uh, there we go. Now, the mod SDK will have an orange little EXE thing and when you boot it up, it's going to look like this. You don't, that's not the one, unless you're planning on creating your own game, you do not need this version. Because it has none of the original textures in the game, and it, anything along those lines. Now, the one that you need to install is the one that I will provide down in the link below. Hold on, and this one you also have to log in to use it, the other one you do not. It, the one that I use looks like this. If it boots up to that, then you're using the right version. Now, let's start up by going to your web browser. You're going to go to Google. It's, you, Google shows the search first. So let's do Google and let's search Sandbox 3 version 1.1. Now, you're going to want to look for the mod DB link. Uh, it's going to be in the description, but Crime, Crymod, or now Crydev, got rid of this link or moved it to somewhere that people don't see. So you want to go here, and then you want to go down and download it here, and that will link you to the Crydev webpage. That's where it is. Now, the link that I'm actually providing you will give you a, uh, hold on, is this actually it? Nope, it's doing something weird. But this is a link that I'm going to provide you will instantly start downloading the files for you. So, uh, it installs just like anything else. You just want to install it into your crisis directory. So, let's go right here and then Hold on. Okay, right there, and then you want to go down to Crisis 2, and you're going to find that I've got an editor file on it, an editor folder. And then bin 64. So, click on the link down in the description, and it will download it. I'll start making tutorials more, more or less like this one more often, or, and a lot more to deal with CryEngine. So, I actually just need a list of what you guys want, because people are complaining that, like, of all sorts of things, but I need to make a central list of what I need to do. So, uh, go on my Twitter page, Twitter-KLLN for M and Y, just like my YouTube page, and send me a Twitter response saying what you want to see and I will try and get that done because school slowed down now finally it's awesome that it slowed down and I want to know what you guys want me to make and I'll, I'll do it because I enjoy making videos and I enjoy mapping and stuff so thank you for watching don't forget to comment like and subscribe Killing for Money, signing out.